She was like, can you take your t-shirt off so I can see your body? I was like, oh, and she was like, what? And I just started sobbing. Jojo Siwa has opened up about her body insecurities in a brand new podcast. I can't, like this is gonna open a can of worms that I've suppressed for years. I'm fine how I am, like, I can't, I can't open this can of worms. Not today, not here, not now, not this year. The 20 year old star reflected on her time on Dancing with the Stars, recalling the moment professional dancer Jenna Johnson made her confront the body confidence issues. We looked in the mirror and we said some affirmations and she said, she said, I'm gonna help you because I know what you're, I know what's going on in your head right now. And she, she helped me, but it's still so hard. Now Jojo shares workout videos regularly on Snapchat, which she revealed was inspired by Jenna's words of wisdom. She's who got me into working out. She's who got me into feeling good about myself, got me into body confidence. And all that exercise to feel bold and strong in her own body served Jojo well when she faced up against an Olympian in a boxing match. She faces number three, Jojo Siwa. Jojo Siwa faced a grueling boxing match against an Olympic gold medalist, and worried fans watched on as she suffered multiple punches to the head. As part of the TV series Special Forces World's Toughest Test, the super fit dancer had to put on a display of aggression to beat her opponent, Olympic speed skater Aaron Jackson. She shared how her home workout routine includes boxing, and so she hoped this would be an advantage. That's more like it, come on! Despite the heavy beating from 31-year-old Aaron, Jojo fought back, landing multiple dangerous shots and winning the fight. Number three, winner. Number six, loser. It seems JoJo's home workout routine has served her well as she makes her way through the brutal reality competition. JoJo Siwa has been batting off her ex-girlfriend drama and sex podcast scandal with high-intensity workouts to keep her washboard abs in check. And now she has sent fans wild, revealing she has a new mystery crush. But did the grueling routines she endured on Dance Moms do more harm than good? As a trained dancer, JoJo is used to high-intensity workouts, often going for two hours at a time. She starts with some stretches and then skips for 10 minutes, followed by some double-unders and crisscrosses. She then does medicine ball slams, mountain climbers, and plank shoulder taps. After this, she dives into assisted pull-ups, tricep push-downs, hanging leg raises, and weighted pull-downs before 12 minutes of treadmill sprints. JoJo's used to intensive routines, and the world watched her get every dance move correct on Dance Moms for the ruthless Abby Lee. Miller. Being in the spotlight so early on meant JoJo didn't lead a normal life, and she shared on Ashley Gavin's We're Having Gay Sex podcast how being on the show directly affected her sex life. I don't know really what normal teenagers do, but I'm assuming that it happens. A car, a park, a bathroom know, stall, yeah, like yeah. Wh whatever, you know what I mean? But like, because of who I am, like, I can't. Do that. Even though Jojo mentioned she struggled socially because of her upbringing, her dancing remains her strong suit, and she often dedicates hours to perfecting routines. One dance in particular she shared with her followers was her Disney dance, which plays to the song friend like me from Aladdin. In the dance, Jojo does high-intensity jumping, jazz squares, and pivot turns until she aces all the moves. Even though Jojo doesn't play when it comes to her career, her messy relationship with Avery Cyrus was blasted all over the internet. The pair were seemingly happy until their breakup.